Yeah, Jessica, those Oklahoma groups hitting the roads right now as we speak. Want you to take a look. This is I-35 southbound. They're headed to Texas right now. They're going to be helping rescue people, but also helping with things you might not expect. The call came early today. We got a request this morning for a shower trailer to go down to Texas, and uh, so we are sending a shower trailer that's got four stalls in it. A hot shower, not just for victims, but for workers as well. As they walk through all the devastation that they see and the debris that they have to walk through, um, they're, they're emotionally drained. And many of the workers who use the showers provided by Oklahoma Baptist Disaster Relief will likely be fellow Oklahomans. Oklahoma Emergency Management tells us they've had boots on the ground for a while. Uh, right now we have 14 uh, teams that have gone down, Swift Water Rescue Team. We've had personnel down in Austin since last Friday from our office. Of course here I think this is going to be more of a long-term event. And as relief efforts continue, Oklahoma crews are ready to help feed tens of thousands of people every day. We'll send a big feeding unit with 45 people able to deliver about 25,000 meals a day. 25,000 meals every day and I want to take you back to those shower units because the Oklahoma Baptist Disaster Relief Director tells me on top of those shower units they also have laundry units so while they're showering they'll also be able to wash their clothes. Reporting live at I-35 in Wilshire, Abigail Ogle, KOCO 5 News.